Am I the only one that like low-key hates Snapchat? Hey! Oh my god, my eyes are like watering because of school. Kidding, but also I do tear up a little bit every time I have to walk into school, so. <laughs> it's 9.55 and guess where we're going? You're not gonna guess it, but I'm so excited. We're going to Panera. Panera Bread. Was it Chicago Bread Company? Is that... I'm gonna get broccoli, cheddar, mac and cheese, and a bread bowl, and lemonade. <laughs> I'm, so, I'm so excited, oh my god. I never treat myself to lunch, and I'm doing it. I'm doing it today, and you're coming with me, so. Is it weird that I'm getting lunch at 10? Like, is that weird? Are they serving lunch? So I went to Panera, and then I was like, wait, what if they're not serving lunch yet? So I Googled it, and they start serving lunch at 10.30, and it was not 10.30. So I went to Target to pass time, and I'm gonna do a little haul. I don't have that much money right now, so I got two things. <laughs> I got some micellar, some micellar water, because I went to my friend's house and she had it, and I tried it, and it worked so good. And I was like, yeah, I'm definitely not getting off all my makeup every night, so. And then I got gum, because I'm a high schooler. So yeah, now we're gonna go to Panera. We got the food. This is the bread bowl. This is the soup. Do I have to pour it in to the bowl? That's crazy. I'm home. Dude, I get so much road rage. Like, it's actually not good. I think we're just gonna do this, like, in the car because I'm so hungry. Hello? Hello? Do I have to carve it out myself? What's going on here, man? I should definitely be inside for this. Like, my poor car. I was standing in this Target aisle for, like, 10 minutes staring at these Revlons. I was like, should I do it? Should I? And when I checked my bank account and I didn't. Y'all hear that? That's my engine. Maybe I'll just turn my car off. Okay, tell me if I'm like crazy or like is just me, but am I the only one that like low-key hates Snapchat? Like I feel like a lot of people would yell at me for that because like it's kind of like really big. Like our culture for some reason but i deleted snapchat for like a solid five six months and i'd never been happier for lint last year my mom challenged me to delete tiktok and i did and i was feeling very insecure and like depressed and i kind of had a feeling that snapchat had something to do with it so i was like i'm gonna add snapchat to the challenge like it wasn't part of it, but I made it part of it. I mean, TikTok is an addiction, and I think we're all doomed. We're all addicted. It's not going anywhere. But Snapchat, I feel like it can just go away. Like, the reason that I hate it so much is because it just makes me feel ugly. You open it, and immediately, immediately when you open it, you see yourself, and you open it at a lower angle. So then you see yourself at a bad angle. Actually, I look kind of good right now. Which sucks, it's like, on your good days you're like, yeah, your confidence is boosted, and then on your bad days you're like, I'm literally the ugliest person alive. But then you look in a mirror and you're like, wait, but I'm not that bad, but then you open Snapchat, but you're like, what am I? A troll? So I deleted Snapchat, and I literally had never been more confident or happier. I recently got it back, because it's like really big in teenage culture, and it's like how you communicate with people, so I had to get it back for that. But honestly, I might delete it again. What if we all just delete it? What if we all just collectively say Snapchat? So yeah, tell me if anyone else feels like this. And if you're like feeling like ugly and secure and stuff, you should delete Snapchat and then tell me like if it helps because it really helped me. So yeah, I'm gonna go inside and eat now. And I've gotta write an essay, which sucks, so.